I do enable my son Oren. I am paying for most of the things for Oren. He rarely eats, but when he does, I'll pay for the food. And sometimes I will pay for the water, I'll help him with his laundry. This summer, I had enough. I had asked him to leave, which was hard. He was supposed to go. I'd given him deadline day, and really it was on me that I back-channeled, told him that he could have more time. I look at details, and I was looking at, she says you're in your room all the time, so I was looking at this picture of your room, and I see one, two, three, four, five plastic water bottles in your room, and you're a role model. Do you know how long it takes for a plastic water bottle to biodegrade? Educate us about a thousand years. So you have a collective 5,000 years of plastic there that has to biodegrade. But yet you want me to believe that you're here as a role model sent to save our environment. We are not perfect. <laughs> oh my goodness. We also own a swell bottle. You also what? Own a swell bottle. What's that? It is a reusable and recyclable bottle that we can fill up that keeps the temperature cold or hot depending on what the temperature of the liquid is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We call that a thermos. <laughs> uh, oh, my goodness. Here's the reason that this is of importance to me. If you really are passionate about the things that you're talking about, you could have a whole lot greater impact by approaching this in a way that would be taken more seriously than telling people that you're a cyborg, even if you are. And it would seem if higher beings had sent you back to accomplish a task, you would want to do it in the most efficient way possible. It just all seems illogical if you're serious about what you want to accomplish. Is any of this getting through to you, Warren? Of course, we are listening. Okay. When you were younger, the Orin before the collective consciousness, you said you always wished you had superpowers like teleportation and were accepted at Hogwarts instead of settled for business school. Is it possible that in your mind you've created your own personal Hogwarts? Doesn't everyone have their own personal Hogwarts? Their own safe space, imaginary? The world is difficult, hard to get through? I think you're probably right. And the thing to do is manage that in such a way that you can be most effective. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.